Hello, and welcome to the Idea Exchange blog. Today's episode is about integrating Google Apps and Moodle. Many of you probably already use Moodle and or Google Apps at your school. However, have you thought about how these tools can work together? In this episode, I will show you how to embed Google Docs into your Moodle classes as links or as actual documents using an iframe generator. To get started, you want to be logged in to both Google Docs and Moodle, and have them open in separate tabs. Next, you'll either create a new Google Doc, or choose an existing Doc to be published. The publishing process is required in order for your document to have a web address that is accessible by others. However, before publishing your Google Doc as a web page, you'll want to remove any restrictions that require entering a password. To do this, Open the Google Doc you would like to publish and click on the Share button located in the upper right hand corner. A drop down menu will appear. Select the option See Who Has Access. A new box will appear listing the names of the people who have access to this document. Just below those names, you will see Sign In is required to view this item, followed by the word Change. Click on the word change and select the option to let others view this document without signing in. Then save and close. Next, you'll, you'll need to publish this document. Click on the share button once again and choose publish as web page. You will see a button for publishing your document as well as a checkbox for automatically republishing the document when changes are made. Checking this box is useful, especially if you plan on making frequent changes to the document. Once your document has been published, you should click on the link to view your document. Next, highlight and copy the web address of your document. This will be needed when adding a link or an embedded version of your document on your Moodle page. In Moodle, you can link to this document as you would any other document. Simply select Add Resource, Link to File or Website, give the link a name, paste the link of your Google Doc in the appropriate field, then save and return to your course. You can paste this link in multiple classes, giving you the ability to update multiple classes simultaneously. Embedding a Google Doc is useful if you want the actual text to display on your Moodle page. This requires some knowledge of HTML. But luckily, there are websites that do this for you. In other words, if you can copy and paste, you can embed a Google Doc on your Moodle page. Let's get started. First, you'll want to Google the term iframe generator. Typically, the first hit will get you where you want to go. The idea behind this is to paste your document's URL into the appropriate place. Decide how tall and how wide you want it to appear on the page, and generate the code. Once you have the code, just copy and paste it in the desired location of your Moodle page. Note, this only works if you're editing your Moodle page in text mode. How do you know if you're in text mode? Basically, if you can't underline, center text, or use any of the buttons above your text, you are in text mode. In the editor, there's a button that has a less than or and greater than symbol. This allows you to toggle between text mode and the what you see is what you get mode. This has been an Idea Exchange podcast. Thank you for listening.